Ka-ching. What's up, Money Geeks? Mr. V here. Welcome to another video, guys. So in this one, we are going to do a review of our trades today. Um, yesterday, guys, I apologize. I didn't get a chance to do a review. As you can see, this uh, bottom here is trades from yesterday, um, which, was, which was a great day. So today, um, we got Clover Health, and um, that's been the monster of the day. A lot of people have been making um, some good money off of that. So we're going to take a look at um, how I traded Clover Health. But before we get started, guys, if you're new to the channel, we talk about how to earn money, how to save money, how to invest and build wealth. So if that's something that interests you, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and the notification bell so you don't miss out on new content. So again, guys, let's jump in and take a look at uh, Clover Health and see uh, what's going on there. So if we can go right here, this is Clover Health. And uh, Clover Health came right out of the gate. And uh, it was, if you can see here, it was about $13 and some change um, um, as of yesterday. Um, and then uh, pre-market, it spiked all the way to about a high of almost $17 um, before pulling back and just barcoding on just right up uh, VWAP there through the rest of the morning until open. So right at open, this is where I traded the stock, right at open. So I got in here uh, somewhere around $17.30 uh, and then it squeezed all the way to um, 19. That's why I took profit. And right there, it's, look at that flush. It just did flush back and then consolidated again and um, tested VWAP. So, but that wasn't the end of the story. So I stepped away uh, from this, came back, and this is what happened. It squeezed from 19 to 20, almost $25, guys. This is insane. This is like the move of the century. Like you're sitting there looking, it's like, hey, this is what I wanted, uh, but I missed out on this. But hey, I can't complain. I made some, I made some good profit. Um, did I want to make more? Of course. But um, again, this is what it is. And this would have been the best place to actually trade this stock right here. This would have been the easiest trade um, possible. Because as you can see, uh, if you go from here where you get into the trade, look at that volume. Stochastic crosses to the upside. Volume comes in huge. And it just kept going up. And the volume just kept coming in and in and in until it got to almost 25 bucks where you could secure profit. Like you could pretty much close your eyes and trade it this one and made some profit. So that was one that I missed out in. Uh, hey, I mean, you you live to die another day. So um, for the other stocks that I traded, uh, let me see, let me bring that up here. So I traded next, um, next to, it came out of the gate. Um, I missed this first part right here. It, it, it kind of went through a halt here. After the halt, came out of the halt and then pulled back. So I didn't trade this area right here, but it, it would have been a good place to trade it. Um, here's where I traded it somewhere around here. So I'm watching my indicator stochastic. K line crosses to the upside. So um, and then I got in here at about 5.4, and then it squeezed all the way to um, 6.1, but I got out at about 5.8, I think 5.89, somewhere around there. That's where I got out. And if you can see, because stochastic K-line crosses to the downside, and so it pulls back, and I got out of that trade. And ever since then, uh, it's been uh, tr just trading below VWAP, and you guys know I don't trade below VWAP. So I wait if there's any opportunity there. If I have to trade um, in the afternoon, I might uh, take a crack at it. Um, so those are the two key ones that I traded. Uh, but again, let's take a look here. Like um, Other meme stocks like AMC uh, came out and actually – Tested $60 for the day, which, I mean, I think uh, for AMC, that was pretty lousy because I had AMC on our watch list. And for those of you that are not part of our uh, Discord community, I have the link in the description. You can click it, come join for free. Um, we put out a watch list every day for for free, um, and you can use that to trade. So we had a, a, a price target here for about 65 but it didn't get there. So it got to $60 um, and then pulled back. So... We'll see what happens with, with AMC. So if we step back here, uh, Wendy's is another one that I traded. So if I bring up Wendy's here for you guys, right out of the gate when I traded Wendy's, if you can see here, pre-market, Wendy's just squeezed all the way to 29, almost 30 bucks. And then um, I had Wendy's on our watch list. Market opens, I'm looking for a spike, but the reverse happens. Market opens, 
Wendy's actually pulled back. Look at it. Look at it. The spike in volume in the wrong direction. So Wendy's pulled back. And I'm like, oh, this might be a flush. But then I give another crack. So right here, um, when he crosses V uh, VWAP here, tested VWAP. So I thought it was going to go because uh, K line is on the upside. So I took it here about uh, 26, I think 2630, somewhere there. So got in the trade at 2630. Um, it, it popped up a little bit uh, to 2650. And then I was like, hey, I'm going to give an opportunity to bounce back. So I didn't want to put a tight stop loss. Um, then it pulled back and it looks like it was going to break VWAP to the downside. Um, at that point, I was down maybe about 26 bucks. I just cut my losses and, and got away. So uh, knowing fully what I could already have profit on, on Clover, I didn't want to have to give back some of that profit. So that was uh, my, my strategy. So that was my trading for the day. Again, let me know in the comment section uh, what you think about this. If you're new to the channel, guys, we talk about how to earn money, how to save money, how to invest and build wealth. So if that's something that interests you, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and the notification bell so you don't miss out on new content. Also, if you're looking to get started with investing, Weibo has their promotion where if you sign up and deposit $100, you get some free stocks. Links in the description. And as always, guys, do your due diligence. Don't be a greedy savage and stay motivated. Thank you.